wow it has been a while since i have filmed one of these videos but hello how are you guys i'm going to be filming a haul today as you can probably tell by what i've titled this video this is what i've been buying lately so i hope you guys enjoy let's just get straight into it because i've tried filming this like three times already and i'm a bit over it there are a lot of candles so let's start with those my friend that i went to primary school with actually started her own candle business so I'm going to show you the ones that I got because I'm obsessed. I purchased four actually. I got the vanilla one for my mum, but I already gave that to her. And I got three for myself. So this one is caramel vanilla and this is the packaging here. She has her own page on Instagram if you guys want to go check that out. So freaking nice. She operates in Melbourne though and um, in the northern suburbs. So check it out if you guys live in the northern suburbs of Victoria, Melbourne. This one is cinnamon apple, delightful. And then the one that I have been burning is sugar cookies. And guys, let me tell you, I've really made this dirty because the wick inside, like it happens to all of my candles, I burn it for too long and the wick just goes really weird. So that's my fault. They're $15 for this pot and they are freaking gorgeous. The next site I did a bit of damage on is Adore Beauty. Now I did actually mention this in like my recent video, but I know they don't really get a lot of traction and I'm hoping this one does a bit better than that video. So I'm just gonna feature those in again. So number one is another candle, the Glass House candle in Taha. And it's a mini version. Obviously, I don't have freaking a million dollars to spend on a candle. <laughs> I got the Miracle Hair Treatment by Eleven Australia. This is miracle. It is a miracle. It is miracle. <laughs> it's a miracle. This has saved my hair. Seriously. Guys, if you are having trouble with like your hair not being shiny anymore or like stuff like that, like this literally makes your hair look like you've come out of a freaking hair commercial on the topic of hair i finally bought a wet brush these are life changers it just makes my hair feel so smooth and i have literally no knots and it doesn't feel like my hair is literally being ripped out of my scalp so that is worth it to me for spending like 15 bucks on a hairbrush that i will keep for a long time i also got to the innis free facial foam so this is the bija trouble facial foam here it leaves your face feeling so squeaky clean and I have been suffering from like clusters of pimples everywhere just like randomly. I go through really weird stages with my skin like sometimes it's so clear and I mean it is around in my period like time but it's just really annoying when you just get random pimples and you don't know why even though I've been eating a lot of chocolate which might be why. The next store I splurged on was Mecca. Hello beautiful <laughs> um i got three things from there and they're all from frank body i got the anti-makeup cleansing oil i also got the charcoal face cleanser which it actually says to use in conjunction with this so on the back of the box that this came in it actually says to like step four is for double cleansing babes follow with my charcoal face cleanser to target out breakouts and impurities so I really want to give that one a go. I'm really excited for that. Um, I also got the glow mask by Frank Body as well. It says deep puffs, puffy face, brighten and glows. And I mean, isn't that what everyone wants? Next up, we are moving on to cotton on. So just staying on track with like homeware and stuff. I got a new mug. This is the most gorgeous mug I've ever seen. I also got a water bottle. And it is the cutest water bottle I've ever seen in my life. It is just flowers. Okay, moving on to the clothes part. I'm going to actually try these on. Shocker. Really strange for me, but I've put it over me talking. First up, I got some trackies. So I got these blue high-waisted trackies. This is what they look like. They're cuffed at the bottom and really cuffed up here, like very elasticated. So they're called the high-rise track pants and i got them in a size medium because i am not small <laughs> and yeah these were 29.99 i think they were on sale for like 21.99 i also got them in white but they're a bit see-through and i'm really sad about it so i don't know if i'm going to return them or i'm just going to keep them 
but um we shall see you can probably see on camera that they're a bit see-through i mean you can even see the pockets and they're white so you'll see better in the trial clip but they're the same trackies just in white also got this pair of jeans and these are my favorite jeans i've ever owned in my life they are high rise of course they are like straight legs they're not really skinny and then they flare out at the bottom with the frame at the bottom oh my god amazing oh i'm actually in love with these and they were cheap too i think they were only like 50 dollars or something wow i get really orange in this light it's so great next up i purchased this jumper i'm in love with this color like so in love how nice is it it's like a nudie brownie beige color it is a high neck top i actually can't remember the name of this either i'm really sorry but this is what it looks like here it is mock neck it has like flared kind of sleeves the next top is actually the like oatmeal version of the top i'm wearing right now and it's just a basic jumper so it has quite a high neck which i really like as you can probably tell and it's just this like oatmeal-y color and that's the fabric there the sleeves cuff and the finish of it at the bottom is really nice it's like i said before like a um a boxy crop so it's not like a tight fitting crop top which is really nice the next shop is princess polly i got this skirt here which is so cute it's like a school girly skirt quite sexy quite nice um and yeah it is just elasticated at the back and it is quite tight at the front this jumper is kind of the same gist as the one i'm wearing and the one i showed you before from cotton on but this is from princess polly it is a really nice mauvey kind of purpley pinky color and that's what it looks like there again high neck and this one's more of like a woolen material okay so the last bit of this haul is going to be completely random stuff that i bought off amazon and ebay i have never been one to shop on amazon or ebay but i was like might as well give it a go the first two things that i got from amazon is actually two phone cases so i got this phone case here so it's just clear it already has a crack in it so that's good like a scratch don't know how i'm gonna get that off it just says pink on the side i also got this one that's on my phone right now it is so cool i saw this like type of phone case on princess polly but it was of course sold out in every single iphone side oh my god this was the funniest thing so i got like face raises or like eyebrow raises this is how they came in the envelope i got six and they came sticky taped to a piece of paper in the envelope so that was fun i got six of those for my drawers in my desk which is where i keep all my makeup and stuff like that i actually got these extra like acrylic things so these are for the powders that i own are there already cracks in here am i okay how did that happen Okay, there's already cracks in these, which is so great. So this is for like my powders, like my bronzers and stuff. Because at the moment they're in like just a... I'll show you. They're just in one like this and they kind of like... They get modelled up and everything. I think it would be a lot easier if I had something that separated them all. So I'm excited for that. And then I also got one like this, which is also separated. But it's a lot bigger, which I'm going to put my eyeshadow palettes in. That is everything that I got. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I know I haven't done a haul in quite a while. I do them in like my vlogs and everything, but I like dressing up and like putting on a full face of makeup, which I haven't done in such a long time. And I went a bit overboard. I just wanted to play with colors. Also, tell me what you want to see from me. Have a good day or night or whenever you're watching this and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.